you what a dual degree can help you achieve and so here are the details for you. These students have definitely made up their minds. Most of them have already decided what they want to do and that's why they have taken up a dual degree course. That's right, these are students who are pursuing an MBA tech degree immediately after class 12. A 5 year integrated program which makes sure your management skills are in tune with your technical skills. So how exactly does a tech MBA help students? With the dual degree, they are saving one year and they are completing B.Tech and MBA both. They can take up a career, career either in engineering or in management or maybe in both. Knowing what you want to do in life, make sure you get that ticket into the industry pretty early. A course called MBA Tech, which is offering five years of uh, MBA as well as engineering. And uh, I am, uh, uh, I realize that I'll be passing out at 22 as an MBA and as an engineer. NMIMS in Mumbai offers the Tech MBA along with Mukesh Patel School of Technology and Management. The course has been designed keeping in mind the concept of techno managers. Therefore, the first two years are in technology, chemical engineering, telecommunications and manufacturing. Second year onwards, the students are trained to integrate their engineering skills with their management skills and are taught to manage the industry that they have sound technical knowledge in. The students are current in terms of technology as well as management. This is one. Secondly, the program is having a 8 to 10 months industry internship. So they understand the theory and practice in the industry. One disadvantage is that graduating students do not have any work experience apart from a 10 month internship. Added to that is the fact that since the course is integrated, there is a risk of packing in too much in too short a span of time. And there are some other worries too. I know um, finance, I know operations, but I don't get a very great specialization, meaning I'm not provided specialization on paper. However, the trend seems to be catching on, even at the IITs. IIT Kharagpur offers a dual degree MBA in conjunction with the Vinod Gupta School of Management on campus. In fact, 15 students from every batch have the option of going for dual degree after completing the first year. Entrance is on the basis of a qualifying test. IIT Bombay has also announced it will soon offer a dual degree MBA course. Clearly, there is a trend among engineering students to jump and get the best of both worlds at an early age. Some courses you could consider are the Mukesh Patel Institute of Technology along with NMIMS, BGSOM with IIT Kharagpur, USIT with Guru Gobind Singh in the Prastha University, Delhi and the JP Institute of Information Technology. So that's what you call killing two birds with a single stone. But really the dual degree phenomena is pretty new to us. And in fact, there are very few people out there in the corporate world who actually have dual degrees. So we decided to meet up with one such professional to really find out how beneficial the course can be. After having spent long hours at work, Rinal Sharma likes to have a little me time every evening. Rinal was part of the first batch to have completed MBA Tech and is currently working with KPMG. Unlike the majority who do their engineering and follow it up with an MBA, Rinal chose to go for an integrated course. If you do an engineering, it takes four years. If you specialize in any domain, it, it takes at least four years. Again, if, if, if the person wants to have work, he again waits for one or two years and then he does an MBA. Cumulatively, even without a work, this takes around six years. So why not take a commitment for, for, for a lesser period and also which is a very calculated commitment. Started in 2004 at the Mukesh Patel School of Technology, Management and Engineering, NMIMS, this course is still in its nascent stage. Rinal's batchmates were a bit apprehensive about the placements as they'd expected recruiters to be a bit wary of a new course like theirs. However, by the end of the course, things turned out quite well. We've all got placed in prospective organizations in uh, companies like KPMG, in, comp in banks like IDBI, ICICI and a couple of students have also got placed in uh, private equity firms. While for many the five-year course may be a long commitment, Rinal thinks otherwise. For him, all his effort and time have paid off well, especially as he got to experience and learn both the technological as well as management aspects of running a business. 
that I'm from telecommunication. Then I learned the engineering of telecommunication. And in a similar manner, I'd also concentrate on the managerial aspects required in the telecommunication industry. So at the end of five years, I'm more affluent or I'm more, more affluent to my industry domain. Knowing both sides of the coin is definitely an advantage. And with companies more willing and accepting than ever, this surely seems like a cause to go for.